Hey, what's up, guys? This is Steve. I'm going to do a little unboxing and review of Battlestar Galactica, the definitive collection. This is the first time it's been on widescreen, except for the uh, pilot that they released uh, a few years ago. But this is the first time they've released the whole series on Blu-ray in high definition. Um... There's two versions of this. There's the definitive and the remastered collection. The remastered only has the widescreen edition. And this one has both. So it has the widescreen and the full screen uh, edition of the whole series, including Galactica 1980. So the original Battlestar Galactic, Galactica original series the complete series there and the uh, Galactic uh, 1980 is all included in this and uh, of course the uh, the original pilot that they made into a movie is also included in this so <clears throat> what you got here is a, a few bonus features you got uh, uh, some deleted scenes the pilot episode audio commentary Battlestar Galactica remastered remembering Battlestar Galactica a 45 minute retrospective on this groundbreaking series Glenn A. Larson on the creation of Battlestar Galactica Stu Phillips composing the score and more yeah so you know they could have added uh, you know a lot more special features I think but uh, overall it's it, it's an alright package you know uh, let's go ahead and open this up. Now I love this series. It's it's so you know cheesy in in spots, but it's but it it was groundbreaking for its time, and um, you know that's one thing I love about the nineteen you know seventies uh, is because the series you know they were clean, fun. The special effects were amazing for back then, and. Uh, you know, I just love that, uh, just the the whole '70s vibe on this series. But and it, and it's it's really funny too in, in spots. So, um, but some people might think it's cheesy for the time now. But you know, here's the uh, the pilot that they turned into a movie, 35, 35th anniversary, and then there's Galactica, 1980 remastered and uh, full screen. So if you're a purist. You definitely want to get the definitive collection. Um, now I've read reviews on Blu-ray.com and and uh, some other sites about the cropping issue. You know because they they cropped it to to do the widescreen, but you know to be honest, you don't lose much at all. I mean, all you do is lose a little background. Uh, you know, as far as like the walls and, and different things that you're not even going to pay attention to anyway. So I really don't see the big deal in that. I really liked it. I really like it in widescreen. And um, I think a lot of people new to the series will like it in widescreen just because everybody's so used to watching widescreen. But yeah, I, I understand that some people are going to have a problem, you know, with it. And uh, there was a few other issues. But, you know, as far as the the age of the series and things, they did remove, uh, yeah, there's a scuff on this disc right here that I wasn't too happy about, you know, paying that much money for the disc. And there's a scuff on the on the front side of it. Now, when I originally did, I, I originally did a review on this and as a joke I called it uh, Battlestar Galactia and uh, <laughs> some people did. I don't think they liked it so I decided to do a do another one with a voiceover calling it by its original title because the, the, the reason I did that, now you're just seeing the, the discs. And of course, Universal did not put any artwork on it. Uh, that's, you know, that's Universal for you. They like plain, 
discs. So the unboxing part is not very exciting. Nothing to show you. So anyway. Yeah. So I, I when I was younger, I used to call Battlestar Galactia. I don't know why. I know how to read, you know. It's Battlestar Galactica. But as a joke, because some people knew I used to say it wrong, I decided <laughs> to see if they noticed. And of course, uh, I had some people that I didn't know notice and call me out on it and say, how can you be a, a fan if you're calling it Battlestar Galactia, you know, blah, blah, blah. And I, I get that, you know, they didn't see the humor in it, but uh, that's the reason I did. So I decided to put up another video. All right, guys, I'm back. Okay, I just went back and forth between the widescreen and full screen. And I'm, I'm here to tell you the widescreen looks amazing. There is some print damage specs and, and dirt um, here and there, but it doesn't detract from the viewing. The widescreen sound is, is also much better. I, I tried it both ways and, uh, you know, through, the, through headphones and through a system and I'm telling you the the widescreen version is the way to go in my opinion I don't know if I would upgrade to the definitive collection if you've already got the DVD version of the full frame um, set because I don't know how much you're really gonna watch the full frame full frame uh, once you see the widescreen uh, you really I really didn't notice any loss. It didn't look stretched at all. It's amazing what they did um, to make this into widescreen. And I couldn't tell anything lost. I mean, yeah, you might get a little piece of a wall or whatever, but you're not going to pay attention to that anyway. So unless you're a real diehard purist like me, I'd probably just go with the remastered version, but if if the uh, if the price is right on this, then pick it up. If you think you're gonna, you know, want the full frame, or if you've never got the DVD set, you might want to get the definitive collection. Either way, you can't go wrong. All right, guys. So I decided to play the original review I had on the original video, and. I know some of the review sites said that the the uh, colors looked a little blue tinted, uh, maybe washed out a little bit, but it's more it looks to me more film like, so that's why I liked the widescreen uh, better than the full frame. It wasn't so vibrant, but it was more film like. So I think you're gonna enjoy it. So if you get the definitive collection and you like. Or, or the remastered, whatever. Tell me what you think about the widescreen version. I appreciate you watching this video. Please subscribe, um, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Thanks.